shots. So we got the Brian, the Marta. From, this man is what, 18, 19 years old? He's like young he's, and already I think he doing might be some. He's 20 now. He's, but he's always going to be. He's got that baby Not face. even he's got old that baby enough face. to drink yet. And this man has been taking names since before he even turned 18. I've seen this young man at the age of 17 at some of our biggie events and such. And I remember he's been rolling into NOBC and, you know, starting to take heads. He was dismantling, and now he's only gotten more dangerous. Imagine what happens when this man can finally get a drink in his system. I want to see a drunk tie. Um, That's going to be hilarious. I'm a little spooked about that. But, I mean, you <laughs> also got Apollo. He had to beat Trizian Pools to get here. You know, he beat Nate for top eight. Ex almost exclusively plays Akuma. I've seen that little Lydia, but not, like, in bracket. Uh, and he, you know, straight through winners. And he was smooth sailing all the way to top eight. Ty, you know, obviously plays the Brian and the Marduk. Uh, he beat Luke in Pools, you know, to get into top 16. He then beat Fred Distance at a, actually a closer, you know, too close. Uh, that was definitely a, a much closer run back because previously in the other game they had played, it was very much in Ty's favor, but Fred yeah. definitely gave him much of a fight. But let's see how much of a fight he gives Shin Paulo's Akuma. We're going to be jumping right into it. That keep out's going to be real important for Ty just to keep, you know, Akuma from getting in and really applying that pressure. Precisely. And it's a pretty solid pick with Brian, who's a very defensive character, so he can play that keep out game and slowly keep him at bay. But, you know, it is Akuma, and God help you if he's got meter or rage or both. Oh, good you Lord. You know, you're, you're fighting for your life out there. Precisely. Kakuma's never really out of a match. No, Kakuma's very much like Paul. You never really have the life lead until it says KO. That's exactly <laughs> it. But in the meantime, he's still at a pretty... Slight life lead on Ty at the moment, playing the keep out slightly better than him. About 15 seconds left on the clock, and the man's oh, oh getting he a floated float. him into the Got wall. Him at the wall. Taunt, not, oh, quite. not quite. 10 seconds left on the Got clock. The meter. Spent he the burns bar. a demon flip, and that's five seconds left. What does he got? Plus frames. Who spends the rage? Doesn't get anything out of it. So times him out. It's one of those things. If he overcommits, he's dead anyway. But sometimes. He's got to throw it out there. Plus, Akuma's got those teleports. Precisely. He can run away if he really wants to run away. Oh, interruption. Nicely done. And he's now getting him. to toss you to DP twice. He's getting him very close Balcony. to this wall. And I know he does not want to be here right now with the Akuma. cross -ups. What game is this again? Oh, oh spinning the, the rage. Meter, but he didn't get him. Oh, we're getting the punish off of that hatchet kick. Oh, Lots he dies. Eh. Balcony's behind him. Uh, I think we're going to the wall. Going outside. We're going downstairs. We yes, are. Yes, we are. And he still got rage. Now they're Big both damage. wearing the red oh, dress the with the side switch. Ooh, that was dangerous. That was definitely very risky. In a game like Tekken, it's very scary when Akuma has to jump a lot because it's very dangerous to get floated out of those things. And now with the down four and the DF1, it's now two straight for Shin Paulo. Really being very clutch in a lot of these matches. Ty not getting a whole lot out of his rage, where God knows if he hits rage, it will be it will spell the end. Paul is definitely being really good about poking down and not going too crazy with the heavier moves. But oh, oh as what I a sidestep punish! That was clean. Ooh, Take him to the wall. To the wall, just slightly. Oh, we're getting some taunt setups. Here. Taunt setups. Not quite. Oh, it's interrupted. Jumps oh, over the low. Hurt. He's got the meter. The wall it, flat. It. Oh, oh, and the, the cross up tech. Raging demon. He's dead. Oh, that is what a clutch play. He's gonna and die that for is that. That three was rough. Straight in game one for Shin Paulo. And there was a lot of clutch moments from Ty, but Shin Paulo clutched out every single one of them. Those, this is going to be an those, uphill battle. Those cross up Tatsus were doing a lot of work, especially in that last round. And I don't think Ty was ready for those. God, cross ups in Tekken, right? My man is pulling out absolutely all the. It, Low key disturbs me that we can say we have cross up tech with this game now. We're not used this to this. Marvel, what are you watching right now? This is why I say, and I would, I mean this from the soul of my heart. <laughs> Akuma plays Street Fighter and Tekken better than some characters play Tekken and Tekken. Yeah, yeah, ain't that the unfortunate truth for some of those characters? Like of all of the 2D characters, like I said, at least with Geese, he will play solid Tekken, and if he does, he gets rewarded by getting to play KOF. <laughs> Akuma is Street Fighter straight out the gate. Is that, why, is that why Geese wasn't confirmed for the new KOF yet? <laughs> Possibly. They're, they're trying to work the kinks out of him. He's, he's in trouble from uh, from all this uh, Tekken action. Problem, like, problematic Tekken. Exactly. They realized, wait a minute. This 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 might be something we need to take care of. Akuma, there's nothing they can do. They've been nerfing him every season, and he's still a threat. He's, he finds a way. Life finds a way. Oh, oh the, the taunt. And we're kicking him to the wall. He's in the Another red dress. No. All right, Ty getting himself on the board with a Piston good Piston punches, round. baby. He's starting to get it popping. On Jungle Outpost, too. Dame's favorite stage, by the way. Shout out, My Big Dame stage. 21, the homie. 
Island and this, they're two of my favorites. They got the best tracks, they got the best looks. Man, I, I'm absolutely an Arctic snowfall guy. MVC and abandoned. Boring. Terrible. What is this? Tekken 3? Ew. Listen, man, I, it, it's the closest <laughs> thing I get to a Yoshimitsu snow stage. That's true. We'll take it. That's true. We need oh, to he's putting in big damage. Taunt setups. These taunt setups are absolutely the crowd is obliterating right it now. Too. His momentum is ridiculous right like, now. He's like, you, you, you want to use your uh, fancy 2D tool? Fine, I got unblockable setups. Oh, with the down. Didn't confirm it. Spends the meter now. And he's two rounds down, which means he probably would have needed that meter. Now he's got to work for it a little bit. He's get, he's closing Dumb in on man. one meter bar. Oh, whiff. But down with the and he's three, at the wall in, with down back three Akuma. Again. Oh, oh no, we're both neutral jumping? Okay, we're actually what playing Street Fighter now. What 2D game is this? <laughs> we are actually playing Street Fighter now. Balcony's that is right behind Paulo. He's got to be careful. Oh, and we're going cool. down What a float. I it, told it, you. It. Take him to, wall. to the wall. Big it damage is time. on setups. What's he got? Oh, my God, baited. My man's got baited. Wrong decision. And he's got red dress. Oh, oh and the PX to steal it. My man's got robbed in broad daylight. So still showing signs of life, but still up two rounds, trying to make this game three. Get these Shotos out of my game. Oh, good <laughs> Lord. Oh, and oh. now nah, we don't do, oh, we don't do focus wall. attacks here, bro. Not here. Again, just slowly poking him out. Oh, that wall, wall bounce is not going to bode well. That wall break is right behind you going to get it. it, it, it. Chose not to not use quite. the wall break here. Burns Punish the that. Yes. At a pretty slight life deficit on Ty's part, but just outside of range of range of rage here. Oh, nice punish there. Oh, and he spent it. He's going to get him with that, he, though. I don't think he's it's going to gonna die from oh, this. No, he's not going to kill him, but it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt a lot. And he's got the red dress on. What's he going to do with it? And oh, just runs up down four unapologetically. Final round, match for Shin Paul. Let's see if Ty can take it to game three here. And slowly playing a. It definitely seems like the keep out game is on the side of Shin Paulo, and he's really forcing Ty's hand. But it's, oh, and no. it's, it it seems the like it's why Shin Paulo's right been there. so clutch thus far. Oh, this Burns is the not meter. good. This is not good for Ty. This oh my the wall. goodness! Gonna, not quite. Not quite. Oh, try to go for the up. cross up again. Catch kick. Catch it kick. He's got him at the wall. On there the we go. Him. Eh, eh. Oh, spins the rage and the throw. Oh my gosh. That was tough. That was tough because oh, Ty never really was boy. never really out of those 